Our bodies are incredible machines and hormones are the messengers that keep everything running smoothly. One crucial group is estrogen, responsible for growth and development, especially in women. But what happens when our bodies encounter chemicals that mimic estrogen? These imposters are called xenoestrogens, meaning foreign estrogens. Imagine a key that fits into a lock, except it's the wrong key. It might jam the lock or even damage it. Similarly, xenoestrogens can disrupt our delicate hormonal balance by mimicking estrogen, potentially causing a range of health issues. These chemicals are everywhere in our modern world, often hiding in plain sight. The good news is that we can take steps to minimize our exposure and protect our health. By understanding what xenoestrogens are and where they lurk, we can make informed choices to create a healthier environment for ourselves and our loved ones. Xenoestrogens are like uninvited guests that sneak into our homes and bodies through various channels. These synthetic compounds mimic the hormone estrogen and can disrupt our endocrine system, leading to a variety of health issues. One major source is pesticides used in agriculture. These chemicals are sprayed on crops to protect them from pests and diseases, but they don't just stay on the plants. These chemicals are designed to protect crops from pests, but they can linger on our food and find their way into our systems. Washing fruits and vegetables can help, but it may not remove all residues. Another common culprit is plastics, particularly those containing BPA or bisphenol A. BPA is a chemical used in the production of certain plastics and resins. BPA is used to make plastic containers, water bottles, and even the lining of food cans. This means that many of the everyday items we use can be sources of xenoestrogens. When heated or scratched, these plastics can leach BPA into our food and beverages. This is why it's important to avoid microwaving food in plastic containers and to replace old, scratched plastic items. Even our personal care products can harbour xenoestrogens. Many shampoos, lotions and cosmetics contain chemicals that can disrupt our hormones. Some shampoos, lotions and cosmetics contain parabens, phthalates and other chemicals that can disrupt our hormones. These ingredients are often used as preservatives or to improve the texture and scent of products. These chemicals are easily absorbed through our skin, potentially leading to health problems over time. Awareness is key. By reading labels and choosing products with fewer harmful chemicals, we can reduce our exposure. By understanding the common sources of xenoestrogens, we can start making conscious choices to limit our exposure and protect our well-being. Opting for organic produce using glass or stainless steel containers and selecting natural personal care products are steps in the right direction. Hormones are like messengers in our bodies, carrying vital instructions for growth, development and reproduction. When xenoestrogens interfere with this delicate balance, they can wreak havoc on our health. In women, xenoestrogens have been linked to a range of reproductive issues including endometriosis, infertility, and even certain types of cancer. They can disrupt menstrual cycles, cause fibroids, and contribute to early puberty. Men are not immune to the effects of xenoestrogens either. These chemicals can lower sperm count, reduce testosterone levels, and increase the risk of prostate problems. They can also contribute to weight gain, especially around the abdomen. Children are particularly vulnerable to the effects of xenoestrogens because their bodies are still developing. Exposure to these chemicals has been linked to early puberty, impaired brain development and increased risk of certain cancers. Section 4. Protecting ourselves, reducing xenoestrogen exposure. While we can't completely eliminate xenoestrogens from our environment, we can take steps to significantly reduce our exposure and protect our health. These synthetic compounds found in various products can disrupt our hormonal balance and lead to health issues. It starts with making informed choices about the food we eat, the products we use and the environments we create. By being mindful of our daily habits, we can make a significant difference. One of the most effective ways to limit xenoestrogen exposure is to choose organic fruits and vegetables whenever possible. Organic farming practices avoid synthetic pesticides and fertilizers, which are common sources of xenoestrogens. 
Organic produce is grown without the use of synthetic pesticides, which are a major source of these harmful chemicals. By choosing organic, we reduce our intake of these substances. When it comes to packaged foods, reading labels is crucial. Look for products that are free from harmful additives and preservatives, which can also act as xenoestrogens. Opt for products that are BPA-free. BPA, or bisphenol A, is a chemical found in many plastics and can leach into food and beverages, posing health risks. Look for alternatives to canned goods as the lining of cans often contains BPA. Instead, choose fresh or frozen options or products packaged in glass jars. Choosing glass or stainless steel containers for food storage can also make a difference. These materials do not contain harmful chemicals that can leach into your food. Avoiding the use of plastic wrap can also make a difference. Beeswax wraps and other eco-friendly alternatives are great options for keeping food fresh without the risk of chemical exposure. Remember, small changes can have a big impact. Each step we take towards reducing xenoestrogen exposure contributes to our overall well-being. By making conscious choices and reducing our exposure to xenoestrogens, we can protect our health and the well-being of future generations. Together we can create a healthier, more sustainable world for everyone. Section 5. Choosing wisely food and kitchen safety. Our kitchens should be havens of nourishment, but they can also be sources of xenoestrogen exposure if we're not careful. Xenoestrogens are synthetic compounds that mimic estrogen in the body and can disrupt our hormonal balance. Fortunately, there are simple steps we can take to minimize risks and create a healthier cooking environment. By making informed choices, we can protect ourselves and our loved ones from these harmful chemicals. Start by choosing organic produce whenever possible. Organic fruits and vegetables are grown without synthetic pesticides which means they are less likely to contain harmful residues. Organic fruits and vegetables are grown without synthetic pesticides, reducing our exposure to these harmful chemicals. This not only benefits our health, but also supports sustainable farming practices. If organic options are limited, be sure to wash all produce thoroughly under running water before consuming. This helps to remove any pesticide residues and dirt that may be present on the surface. When it comes to cooking, Opt for glass or stainless steel cookware instead of non-stick varieties. These materials do not release harmful chemicals when heated. Non-stick pans often contain PFOA, a chemical linked to hormonal disruption. Over time, these chemicals can leach into our food, especially when the cookware is scratched or overheated. Cast iron and ceramic cookware are also good alternatives. They are durable, safe, and can enhance the flavor of your meals. Remember to store food safely. Proper storage helps to maintain the freshness and nutritional value of your food. Avoid using plastic wrap, which can leach chemicals into food, especially when heated. These chemicals can be harmful to our health over time. Instead, opt for glass containers with lids or reusable beeswax wraps. These alternatives are safer and more environmentally friendly. These simple swaps can make a big difference in reducing our exposure to xenoestrogen. By being mindful of our choices, we can create